Well, hello and welcome. Hello. Mel's with me. I am. That means only one thing. Who? Yep, we're going for another pub lunch. Yeah. And this time, it's the turn of the fox in St. Bride's in the Vale of Glamorgan. And I'm looking forward to this one. Well, we're here today in the village of St Bride's Major, which is on the western side of the Vale of Glamorgan, South Wales, and only a few miles south of Bridgend. And the name St Bride's actually comes from this church. I did not know that. St Bridget. And this church was established in 1141. As I haven't got that much time to do a video around the village, I have walked this area before, and I've made a few videos about, say, Brides and Ogmore Downs and the area around here. And I'll link those below, and they should be coming up at the end as well. At the moment, I'm sheltering under a tree in the churchyard because it is raining quite heavily. But let me take this opportunity to tell you about the pub where we're going. The Fox in St Bride's, originally called the Fox and the Hounds, a traditional village pub, an old stone-built pub. It was taken over, I think in 2020, by Gavin Henson. If you're not Welsh or not into rugby, you may not know who he is. He was a Welsh rugby player. He played for Wales in, I think, the early 2000s, to about 2011, I think, for Wales and clubs until I think he retired in 2019. But he was quite a rugby celebrity, famous because he, his first wife was Charlotte Church. So you no, know, may know Charlotte Church. Anyway, I'm not here to do a, a gossip column. He now has a new wife and with her, he's opened up the Fox and Hounds as a bar and restaurant just known as the Fox. It's got good reviews, but I've spoken to a few people who said, oh, it's meant to be really nice, but I haven't spoken to anybody that's actually been. <laughs> but the reviews online are good. So like I said, we're meeting Sean and going for a birthday lunch. I've just popped back to the car to get Mel. You're telling me off for talking. I also told you it wasn't going to rain either. You also, yeah, also told me it wasn't going to rain. Mm -hmm. Never anyway, shall we go over to the Fox and wait for Sean there? Yeah, I think so. Hello, Sean. You can't vote with me for being late today. No, you're, on, you're actually early. The pub we've got, right, is a lot of music playing. So what are you having? I'm having a venison casserole with champ and crispy kale. It's interesting. Uh, I'm going for the duck roulette, um, so that's going to be interesting. And a Herefisher skirt steak. Um, the pie crust is missing. It's been replaced with a bonbon. bonbon. So we will find out what that is in a bit. And I'm going for the chicken breast with curry sauce. Never. <laughs> this is with mash, Bombay mash. And Bombay mash, whatever That's Bombay insane. mash is. Does it come with an embargo on top? No, it doesn't come with any embargo. Well, 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 well. I've got the bottom of the stairs. So there's the bread, and that is Marmite butter. Nice. Don't you like Marmite, Sean? Yeah. And what have you got, Sean? Duck roulette. <laughs> Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da
Ja, Kaden. Hi, Kaden. This is a plum parfait. Plum? Oh, because yes, it's a fatty. Smells nice. Mm. Is that good? Mm. It tastes marmite. Yeah. yeah. I think I prefer without the marmite. The bread is good, and Mel wasn't too fast on the marmite batter, but I like it. It's okay. And how is yours, Sean? Nice. Very nice. Very nice. Sean's saying yeah, it's good. Well, Sean's finished. Mm. And it's so by. Mm. By the way, that's a big pebble. <laughs> Which is, it was like a coarse shredded duck in some form of yeah. patty. Then we had duck parfait. Yeah which is like a pâté type thing. And yeah, they had a plum sauce. I don't arrest you, but the beach balls are playing. I know. <laughs> a room um, room. And there's some other, th it's strange, but nice. Crisp breads. Yeah, plum really, sauce. really, really quite well thought out. I feel like I'm on MasterChef. So my chicken's arrived. Here's Sean's. That thing's bigger, the bonbon thing is bigger than I expected. Yeah, well, the... And what have you ordered? Venison casserole. The venison. Thank you. All right, enjoy. It's interesting. Mm. What's it like now? Mmm, really tasty. There's um, the mash is really creamy and it's got spring onions in, which is which is really nice. I'm a bit funny about mash. I don't like smooth mash. But the mm, the casserole is really well flavoured. Quite strong flavour, like a really meaty flavour. <laughs> lovely. So I've got the skirt steak. It's bloody lovely, and uh, this bonbon, mm. it's it's really really tasty. <laughs> tasty. What's it? Bonbon? Is it like um? It's like like a risotto. It is, but it's like meat. But it, I think it's got a bit of alcohol in it as well. Is it? Mm. I really do. But um, when you combine that with a steak, it really, really is tasty. But mine was really nice. Mel's done? Yeah. That was really good, that was. Thoroughly enjoyed that. <laughs> oh, there we are. <laughs> I, have to, I have to clean the camera now. <laughs> Thumbs up from you two? Double thumbs up. <laughs> so I'm going to have plum and almond tart with vanilla ice cream. And I think Sean is going to have the Eaton Mess with autumn berries and ice cream. I'm not having anything. I'm just going to have a coffee. No, Sean's just, um, Marcus is just going to have a coffee. So Eaton Mess for you, apparently? Yes. Sean's gone for a Calypso coffee. What's that? Tia Maria? Yes, it was. Yeah, back in the day. Back in the day? Yeah, yeah during the what do you had a Tia Maria coffee. Tia Maria. And... What do you had? Your chicken in a basket? Yeah, uh, no, that was 70s. Oh, OK. Was actually, <laughs> what, was the, what was the thing in the 80s? Um, mm. What a coffee mess. Yet. I haven't got to the coffee yet. So. Mm. Oh. Such a mess. I'll have to have it, sorry, Sean. I'll have to, yeah. I'll have to try it when you, when you get to, to the, um, when you get to, to the coffee. Now we've got almond and plum tart. With vanilla mm. ice cream. And Sean's got uh, eaten mess. He's got a big booby on his plate. <laughs> Are you going to give it a crack? Go on then. Ooh. 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 That's interesting. Ooh. Actually, yeah, that's... Uh, it's quite very merry go. Mmm. This is 
is really nice. It's like warm plum, warm sponge with plums underneath layered ice cream. Lovely, beautiful yeah. and warm. But the, the battery died on the camera. Oh yeah, the battery died earlier. Yeah. By the time I replaced it, so Sean had finished his. <laughs> Just said you have to be quick. We have to be quick because the music's coming on again. But definitely a big thumbs up for me. You? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Music's coming in again. Mel. Yes? The bill's arrived. And Sean's run away. And Sean's disappeared. What a surprise. So how much do you think it's going to be? Um, ooh. £120. Pounds. £120? Pounds? Let's have a look what's it going to be. Cheaper, 106. 106. Well, you got to me beer coffee, didn't you? <laughs> Bloody hell. That's quite a lot. It's a nice lunch. But it was a nice lunch, you can't but complain. thing is, I don't mind paying more for, a nice... for something that's really, really nice. And it was, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. I have to say, right the way through from the start, it's been thoroughly enjoyable. I forgot to mention. What? If you enjoy our escapades, don't forget to subscribe. Click and subscribe. Yeah. yeah. Oh, give yeah. us a thanks. A thanks, yeah. Super thanks. Anyway, <laughs> as you can see, it's still raining. Oh, yeah. yeah it's not raining. So we're not going to stick around too long. How did you enjoy the meal? Oh, I thought it was excellent. Yes, it was really good, good yeah. yeah. I mean, obviously, the prices are not <laughs> sort of the basic pub prices. It's a gastro pub. Yeah. And you come for, I think you come for a special occasion, but it's excellent i thought a special occasion what's that occasion when somebody else is every paid? day yeah yeah, yeah when no, it was got paid what i liked it was a bit different as well the menu it was a bit a different twist it was, on it yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. And you don't very often see venison these days so and, we and will be back your curry you're all sort of like chicken and the curry sauce that was interesting mm, yeah. isn't it? Really anyway good. it is getting wet yeah. can we go yeah yeah okay i mentioned the videos about this area and i'll link those below and i'll see you in one of those Thank you. so bye bye, bye.